Welcome to the Health and Longevity channel, I'm Dr. Michael. Today, let's explore an easy breathing technique that can increase your oxygen levels. There's a common misconception about deep breathing, where many believe that inhaling deeply brings in more oxygen. But this actually isn't true. If you start taking deep breaths right now, you may feel lightheaded, not more energized. Because deep breathing only increases air intake but does not improve oxygen absorption. Let's dig deeper to understand the role of oxygen and carbon dioxide in our bodies. The air we breathe contains about 21% oxygen but only a tiny fraction, about 0.04%, is carbon dioxide. Interestingly, carbon dioxide is essential for oxygen to be properly absorbed into our cells. This relationship is known as the Bohr effect, which states that oxygen won't leave your red blood cells and enter your tissues unless there's enough carbon dioxide present. Without enough carbon dioxide, oxygen remains in the blood, starving cells of what they need to function. This is why hyperventilating, or breathing excessively, actually deprives the body of usable oxygen. When the body lacks carbon dioxide, a condition called chronic hyperventilation can develop, sometimes called carbon dioxide syndrome. This is often due to chronic stress, causing shallow or fast breathing. Symptoms of this carbon dioxide deficit include heart stress, fatigue, insomnia, muscle twitching, and increased histamine levels, which may lead to nasal congestion and allergies. Chronic hyperventilation can also make the blood more alkaline, interfering with how calcium is processed in the body, leading to tingling sensations and potential nerve issues. A body with low carbon dioxide levels operates similarly to that of a smoker, where oxygen is limited deep in the cells. This creates a cycle where the body constantly feels the need for air, yet struggles to absorb the oxygen it needs. Fortunately, there's a simple way to improve oxygen levels in the cells through a special breathing practice. This technique helps resolve health issues connected to low carbon dioxide levels by training the body to breathe properly, optimizing the use of oxygen without unnecessary strain. Start by practicing relaxed breathing. Aim to breathe slowly and gently, using your diaphragm rather than your upper chest. Inhale for 5 seconds, then exhale for 5 seconds. Practicing this consistently, especially at night, can transform the body's physiology, promoting relaxation and reducing stress responses. Breathing through the nose, not the mouth, is essential. The nose naturally filters, humidifies, and conditions the air we inhale. In fact, nose breathing can improve oxygen absorption by up to 20%, even if it initially feels restrictive. Breathing through the mouth bypasses these natural filters, allowing particles, allergens, and microbes to reach the lungs directly. For better oxygenation during sleep, consider using nasal strips to gently open the nasal passages, improving airflow. Another option is applying a small piece of tape over the mouth to encourage nose breathing through the night. This can help prevent dry mouth, reduce snoring, and promote restful sleep, so you wake up feeling more refreshed. One last tip involves carbon dioxide, drinking carbonated water. Carbonated water, which contains carbon dioxide may help with hydration. Many find they're better hydrated drinking carbonated water compared to plain water. This fascinating effect of carbon dioxide on hydration can support overall well-being. Dr. Michael here and wishing you health and longevity. Don't forget to subscribe.